Some gunmen in the early hours of Saturday set ablaze the Umaguma Divisional Police Headquarters, situated in Oweri West local government area of Imoro State. The gunmen also killed two police cross tables who were on duty. Sahara reporters learned that the attackers stormed the division, division with guns and explosive ordnances, disposers, and they immediately opened fire at the divisional headquarters after blocking the roads leading in and out of the station and including the one close to the local government council headquarters. Residents of the area said the sounds of the weapons the attackers came with frightened them as they ran into the bushes out of fear of being hurt by stray bullets and weapons. A resident of the area who does not want to be mentioned said, these guys are mean. On arrival, they blocked the route, they threw their dynamite into the police station and equally opened fire. They now awaited to attack police officers who ran out for safety. Unfortunately, two police constables by name Ifani and Ike were killed. Ifani was from Omukwo in Omuakuma community here. He was a final year student at Imo State University in Oweri. I knew him. It is just one year now he was recruited. He was trying to scale the fence when they used matchets and caught him. He was sliced. The young man died on the spot. This is very unfortunate, honestly. The second victim, Ike, was from Avon community. They shot him in one of his legs as he fled. He, was, he has been found dead now at a water stand where he possibly went to drink water. This is very un unfortunate. The attack came few hours after the assistant inspector general of police in charge of Zonai Umoya, Isaac Aki, Aki Ayode, left the state after a visit. Hmm. This is really very, very unfortunate. Let's this unnecessary destruction of lives and property stop in the southeast now and the part of Nigeria. There is absolutely, absolutely no gain or dividend for all these killings. What are we going to gain? Now these men they killed are from the southeast too. Who are these unknown gunmen? I always ask this question. Who are these people? Who are these people killing people in the southeast? This is so sad and unnecessary. I am sure Emeka Iyodera would have done a better job. This is not right. These police personnel are also people's fathers, uncles, and brothers. And for those saying police, saying police are bad, remember, they are bad people everywhere. We all know that. They are bad people everywhere. That does not mean that all policemen are bad. All these killings have to stop. You understand? You cannot use words poor date to pay Peter now. It's not fair. All this killing have to stop. You are killing people's children, people's husband, people's breadwinner, people's father. This is really very bad. We understand that the country is, is getting to, I don't know what to say about that one because Nigeria, very soon, the way it's going, it will just shut down on our own you get because nothing is working but you just have to stop killing our brothers and sisters in the name that they are in uniform for how long these people are our own our own blood we have to channel if you have problem channel your problem to the government you know where they are go to aso rock you have the governors those who are supposed to do the needful all these people they are acting by instruction you understand you will just have to stop killing these people. This is not right at all. It's not right. Rest in peace, rest in peace to the officers who died in line of duty, regardless of where they came from. Nigeria failed you. That is the truth. The politicians and corrupted servicemen cannot win the people who own the land. Federal government should conduct referendum. Someone just dropped that. I cannot phantom out the rationale behind this. The IG should do everything to unravel the vampires behind this. It is really very sad. Okay. I watch I watch it on AIT, 
that Imo State is having relative peace. Is this the type of peace they are enjoying from Supreme Court Governor? Hmm. I don't even understand this uh, Imo State and their government and all that. Because when you look at things closely, it's only, only Imo State you, you see these things happening. And sometimes I do ask this question. Why is it that only in the states, unknown gunmen attack people, kill people, you know, and all, all that. In most states is the epicenter of unknown gunmen. But why? That is the question. Why? Why is it happening in only in most states? The governor of Imo states, Hope Uzadema, should look critically into this. There's what they call uh, investigate. Uh, independent investigation find out those who are killing people it's not by you just come at you you will name these people are the people who are killing people are you sure because it's bad when you assume and when you assume those people who are really doing this you are giving them <laughs> a very good chance to continue to operate because they have not been noticed People who are behind this unknown gunmen just want to crush that region, mostly in Imo State. Governor Ho Putzadima should understand this. You understand? Someone said here, they, the police, should discard any false information and have a peaceful coexistence with the unknown gunmen because they are friends. Someone just dropped that. This is not a joke. It's not everything you joke with. This is a serious matter. We are talking about lives here. Okay. They should please stop killing now. These innocent police, they just as an innocent like every other person who try to end to put food on on the table of their families. Honestly, they should just stop this. This is really very, very wrong. Okay, guys, these are some reactions by Nigerians. I'm dropping it here. Can you share your thoughts to us below the comment section? Don't forget to give us a thumbs up. Also, click on the notification button for more updates thank you very much once again god bless you bye for now